Check out the differences between NFTs, crypto and digital currency. With the recent spike in popularity of non-fungible tokens, it's crucial to understand what they are and how they vary from cryptocurrencies and digital currency. Traditional wallets are giving way to digital wallets, which are software-based programs that securely save user payment information. Digital wallets can store both digital currency and cryptocurrencies. Digital currency is currency coins and notes that can be held electronically in a digital wallet. By withdrawing cash from a bank or ATM, a user can convert digital currency into cash. Cryptocurrency is the encrypted form of digital currency. This makes use of blockchain technology and eliminates the need for financial institutions to validate transactions. Non-fungible tokens, NFTs, are unique digital assets that reflect real-world goods. NFTs are not the same as digital currency or cryptocurrency. In this video, we'll look at NFTs, cryptocurrencies and digital money, as well as the differences between them. Hello, and thank you for joining us here at Crypto Dominion. I'm Alison, and I'll be giving you the most up-to-date advice and strategies for everything pertaining to the cryptocurrency field, in addition to a great deal of information regarding the enterprise as a whole and its expansion patterns. So if you're interested, click the subscribe button. On the channel, we frequently upload content related to cryptocurrencies. You may increase your chances of winning our continuing giveaway of a MacBook by giving us a like, clicking the button to subscribe, and leaving a comment below. There will be more info at the end. Let's get started. What exactly are non-fungible tokens? Non-fungible tokens are one-of-a-kind digital assets that represent real-world goods like images, music, films and trading cards. They are kept in a digital ledger and purchased and traded online. Instead of purchasing a real photograph to hang on a wall, the buyer receives an original digital file. NFTs can be created and purchased for nearly any digital asset, such as collectible digital characters, virtual real estate, or original social media postings. Non-fungible means that NFTs are not interchangeable. Each NFT is unique, distinguishing it from fungible tokens, such as cryptocurrencies, which may be swapped for one another. Because NFTs are linked to specific values via certificates of authenticity, the digital assets cannot be traded or replaced because each NFT resides on a decentralized digital platform based on blockchain technology. How does blockchain operate? The fact that blockchain is a sort of distributed ledger technology, DLT, accounts for the majority of its fundamental characteristics. Ledgers have been used to record financial transactions for centuries and have recently been digitized in ERP and other business applications. Unlike centralized systems, DLTs distribute copies of the ledger across nodes on a blockchain network, making each one responsible for recording new transactions and participating in a consensus mechanism to agree on ledger modifications. Another distinguishing feature of blockchain is its proprietary data format, which is what distinguishes it from other types of DLT. Traditional databases store data in rows, columns and files, but blockchain stores information in cryptographically protected blocks that are connected together. The data block and transaction verification procedures make it practically mathematically impossible to modify data or interrupt transactions on a blockchain. There is no central authority for hostile actors to target, no single participant who can take data private, modify the rules unilaterally, or whose failure can bring the entire network down. Data redundancy and transparency are provided via numerous copies. This is how blockchain achieves its immutability. Because the ledger is permanent and tamper-proof, it can be trusted. Another important feature of most blockchains is trust. In human contact, trust indicates that you don't have to go to further lengths to determine whether the information supplied is accurate, such as asking an authoritative figure to authenticate it, or only communicating with those you think to be trustworthy. Similarly, you can believe that the information in a blockchain is correct, for the most part. The situation with blockchain is difficult, as it is with nearly any major computer technology. Blockchain is not always impenetrable. The level of security and anonymity, as well as its utility, are significantly dependent on whether the blockchain runs on a public or private network, and readily available blockchain alternatives offer some of the same benefits, such as data security and storage, but at a lower technological risk and cost. Every blockchain transaction is written to a digital ledger, which publicly records each NFT transaction to prove who owns the object.
the majority of NFTs exist on the Ethereum cryptocurrency's blockchain. The Ethereum blockchain, like Bitcoin, provides permanent digital records of every transaction that uses that cryptocurrency. It also generates an unchangeable ledger of all NFT transactions. The NFT creator retains the item's copyright and the ability to copy it as many times as they like. Although the creator may make several copies of the original, if the buyer of the NFT wants to make copies of the item, they must first obtain permission from the inventor, and each duplicate is considered a unique NFT. NFTs are sold through auction houses or through NFT marketplaces such as NBA Topshot, a flow blockchain-powered online marketplace where users can bid on, buy and sell digital highlights of NBA players. An NBA Top Shot film featuring LeBron James paying tribute to Kobe Bryant sold for nearly $400,000. OpenSea, a peer-to-peer -peer marketplace for NFTs, virtual treasures and rare digital artifacts built on the Ethereum blockchain. Rarible, a public marketplace secured by the Ethereum blockchain that allows artists and creators to issue and sell NFTs. Super Rare, an Ethereum-powered digital art marketplace where individuals can purchase and sell NFTs from top artists. Known Origin, an artist-driven Ethereum blockchain platform where digital producers can authenticate, display and sell their artifacts and artwork. Decentraland Marketplace, a decentralized virtual reality platform powered by the Ethereum blockchain that allows users to construct, enjoy and profit from what they build and own. Arcane Market, a digital collectibles marketplace for collectors and gamers in general. Arcane Market is built on Binance's smart chain, as well as the Ethereum and Polygon blockchains. What exactly is cryptocurrency? Cryptocurrency is a digital money that is encrypted and does not rely on banking institutions to validate transactions. A digital wallet is where cryptocurrency is kept. Anyone can make and receive money through this peer-to-peer -peer system, which uses blockchain technology. When a person sends cryptocurrency, the transaction is recorded in a public ledger. Several businesses have issued their own cryptocurrencies, often known as tokens, that allow users to trade particularly for a company's product or service. To purchase a goods or service, an individual must convert real dollars for cryptocurrency. Bitcoin, a 2009 cryptocurrency, is an example of a popular cryptocurrency. Bitcoin exchanges are markets where anyone may purchase and sell Bitcoin using other currencies. Ethereum, a blockchain-based software platform, on which developers may build smart contracts and distributed applications. Ether is the Ethereum network's cryptocurrency. Litecoin, an open source, peer-to-peer -peer cryptocurrency that allows anyone to make payments without the involvement of a bank or other third party. Tether, a stablecoin whose price is directly proportional to the value of the fiat currency it symbolizes, such as the US dollar, euro or yen. In contrast, the prices of Bitcoin and Ethereum fluctuate significantly. What is digital currency? Digital currency is cash coins and bills that can be saved electronically in a digital wallet. By withdrawing cash from a bank or ATM, a user can convert digital currency into cash. Although digital currency has no physical counterpart in the real world, it shares many similarities with traditional money. A person can acquire, transfer or trade digital currency for another currency. Digital currency can be used to pay for goods and services, Digital currency transactions can be sent from anywhere in the globe to anywhere else. A central bank digital currency, CBDC, is a centralised digital currency issued and managed by a country's central bank. A CBDC represents the electronic form of a country's fiat currency with a digital token or electronic record. Although no country has formally established a central bank-backed digital currency, certain central banks, including a consortium of state-run banks in China, have initiated pilot programs and research initiatives to examine the viability of CBDCs. The Federal Reserve Bank of the United States is also considering creating its own digital money. The following are the various types of digital currency systems. A digital currency system supported by a central bank. Price-stabilized cryptocurrencies, often known as stablecoins. Cryptocurrencies that are not stable, such as Bitcoin, what is the distinction between NFTs, cryptocurrencies and digital currency? There are a number of distinctions between NFTs, cryptocurrencies and digital currencies. The primary distinction is that, unlike digital currencies and cryptocurrencies, NFTs cannot be swapped or replaced. Every NFT is unique 
distinguishing it from fungible tokens such as digital currency and cryptocurrency, which may be traded or exchanged for one another with no value loss. Digital currencies are centralized, which means that a group of people and computers regulate the condition of the network's transactions. Cryptocurrencies and NFTs, on the other hand, are decentralized, with the majority of their particular communities determining the rules. Furthermore, digital currencies are not transparent. For example, because this information is private, an individual cannot pick the wallet's address and view each money transfer. Cryptocurrencies and NFTs, on the other hand, are transparent. Because every transaction is stored on a public blockchain network, any user can view the transactions of another user. A central bank-backed digital currency is essentially electronic cash. A CBDC, like cryptocurrency such as Bitcoin, is data-driven and does not exist in the actual world. CBDCs, unlike cryptocurrencies and NFTs, are supported by governments, making them more likely to be recognized as money that people may use to buy goods and services. Before I send you on your way, let's talk about the giveaway item. A brand new MacBook will be given away when we reach 50,000 subscribers. Simply like, subscribe, and leave a comment on this video to be entered to win. Because this is truly random, the more videos you comment on, the higher your chances are. Hitting the notification bell with all notifications enabled is always the most effective approach to staying updated with the content. And that's all for today's video. If you enjoy tips and tricks on everything cryptocurrency, check out our other videos. Thanks for checking this channel out. Stick around, we'll be posting again real soon.